I found Biddy Horn, who's actually been in the breed for more than 50 years. Now, I understand you had a bit of an unusual start in the breed. Yes, I bought the first dog from a commercial kennel where you, you just bought pets. And um, took him around the show and he used to get seconds and thirds for about three years. A lot of breeders didn't think he was any good. It's a difficult breed to trim. And it took me three years to learn how to strip them and trim them. And eventually got him looking quite well. And I was lucky to drop in, I think, um, with my dog when the fam very famous breeder, Cora Charters, uh, retired. And we never looked back. We got 10 cc's with him. And uh, then he produced another champion for me. Uh, I can't remember how many champions I've had, but we've won well over three, 400 cc's in the time. And um, we had a lot, of, a lot of fun in the breed too, you know. I don't, the breed at the moment isn't as good as it should be. Um, you know, there were some very, very good dogs years ago. But um, it's, we've got to try and get more people in the breed and get them interested, that's the thing really. Because the numbers at the moment, they're, they're not massive in numbers, are they? No, they're not. And the entries going down, I mean, Crufts this year was the lowest entry they'd had for 50 years, which is dreadful. And today there were only 22 entered and about six absent. It's very disappointing, really. That's so, what, what should people at home um, find attractive about the breed? Then, are, are they great family dogs? They're a good family dog. Yes, I mean, uh, my mother had them when I when I was little uh, as pets, and there were a lot of them back in the 30s. And um, then the Westies came in, and everybody went for Westies instead of Celian. Ah. But it is. It, I think that the, for showing, it is the trimming that's very difficult. And I'm assuming because they only come in white, <laughs> yes, that's quite well, a difficult colour to keep white, clean. But we get we get black ears and brown ears oh, and yeah. things like that, you know. Um, and it is because they're white, but they have a very difficult coat. If you if you look at the Westies, they have a very wiry coat and they're easier to trim. The Celium isn't, and you've got to have a lot of patience, you know. And it's it's hard work in actual fact. But you enjoy it. Uh, yes. <laughs> I mean, I'm still doing it. Um, but it is, it's, 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 a, it's a nice breed and we've been in a long time. And anybody who would like to start needs to get to a breeder with, who's, who's got a reputation of breeding good ones and start off. You know, we went, there are one or two new ones here today. You know. Absolutely. They're the next generation, aren't they? That's right, yes. Mm. Well, thank you very much, Biddy. It's been okay. a delight to talk to you. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs>